The inspection process begins by loading a reference object and test object into the system. The reference object is typically a CAD model. Powered by the granite kernel from Parametric Technologies, Qualify can import many CAD interchange formats, including IGES, STEP, ProEngineer, Parasolid, and ASUS. Translators are also available for CATIA v4 and v5. The test object is typically a point cloud generated from a 3D scanner. Most popular scanner formats are supported, as well as generic ASCII XYZ point clouds and most polygonal formats. Before analysis can be performed, the reference and test objects need to be placed in a common coordinate system and orientation. In this example, a fixturing process will be simulated by defining datum targets and features on each object, and these entities will be used to align the models. Creating datums and features on a CAD model is as easy as selecting the type of entity to create and specifying a location on the model. Whereas creating datums and features on point clouds has traditionally been a difficult, user-intensive task, Qualify provides a fully automated method of generating these items on the test object features based upon their counterparts created on the reference object. Now that both the reference object and the test object have corresponding features, the RPS alignment command can be used to align the two objects. Within the command, two windows display the reference and test objects individually and a third window shows the two objects together after alignment. The Auto button will automatically create all datum and feature pairs of the same name and assign a default directional constraint based upon the orientation and type of each item. Finally, the Align button is clicked to complete the process. The objects are aligned and the deviation for each pair is shown in the dialog. The 3D Compare command computes the deviation between the reference and test objects and creates a result object. The result object displays the deviations in a color map, immediately showing the benefit of working with modern 3D scan data. A color spectrum relates the colors in the result object to the numerical deviation values. The spectrum segments and limits can be edited to display the appropriate tolerance information on the result object. The color averaging slider can be adjusted to control the level of detail in the result object. Individual point deviations can be displayed, or areas can be averaged to illustrate trends. After a result object has been created, the boundaries can be compared to check for problems such as springback or trim error. The Compare Boundaries command allows for the selection of boundaries on the result model and computes the deviation to the boundary of the test model. Each boundary comparison stores its view for quick access and inclusion in the final inspection report.
cross-sections can be created for measuring dimensions on point clouds. The section along curve command allows for planes to be defined normal to a specified curve. These planes will be used to simultaneously create cross-sections of both the test object and the reference object. The point cross sections can then be used with the create modify dimensions command. Various measurement techniques are available and distances can be measured between the reference object and test object. The visual appearance of the dimensions can be edited and dimension tables can be included in the final report. Three D dimensions can be created to perform measurements on the reference and test objects using features and datums. Measurements include point-to-point -point and parallel dimensions, angular and radial dimensions, and specification of the measurement plane. Three D dimensions are stored in dimension views, which can be easily accessed and displayed in reports. Once the three D dimensions have been defined on the reference object, the auto create three D dimensions command can reproduce the same measurements on the test object. Reference and test features are transferred to a result model during the three D compare command. The test features are displayed as a dashed line along with the reference features. The compare features command allows for annotations to be placed on the result model, displaying the deviations in the characteristics of the features, including center position and form deviations. Failure analysis extends the Go No Go capabilities of Geomagic Qualify to check for unacceptable deviations in 3D, 2D, and boundary comparison. With a single click, all of these comparisons can be checked, and failure views will be generated in the Model Manager and included in reports. The create report command makes it simple to generate reports in a variety of formats, including HTML, PDF, and Microsoft Word. Default reports include images for 3D views, annotations, comparison views, dimensions, and tabular data. The content and appearance can be easily customized and saved for use in future reports. Automation is a core part of Geomagic Qualify. By inspecting a part once, the reference object has effectively been trained on how the inspection process should be performed. In this case, the result object from the initial inspection is deleted, and the replace command is used to load the new test data. The auto report function displays the reports previously created from the reference object and automatically performs the inspection process. The status window shows the progress as the procedure is completed and a new report is generated. 